All right, hello, hello. I've got my scissors ready. I I probably should take off my watch just cause like, you know, I gotta, I don't wanna know what time it is. We don't care what time it is. Today what I'm gonna do is we're gonna open up Clawful today. Make his dreadful claw grab and hold. And there he is. Look at those feet. Those are buzz off feet or maybe buzz off has clawful feet and there's a uh a buzz off uh claw and there's a clawful claw oh my gosh he's terrible it's clawful's crushing brutality and cunning intellect make him one of he-man's more vicious enemies i didn't know that about him i didn't know that he was cunningly intellectual good for him good for him uh work lever to make claw grab press mace into other claw and then you can twist him into powerful battle positions and of course we've got our is this wave eight yeah i think it's wave eight wave nine is eluding me i'm, I'm at my local target uh, my local store is target and walmart i'm still only seeing uh wave seven so plenty of plenty of sorceress to go around and jitsu and uh naked stratos Okay, here we go. So I'm opening this. Here I go. Um, oh yeah, so I'm trying. To, I was trying to do laundry, and I was trying to time it out so that it would be done when I was going on my break. But it's like one more hour left, and <laughs> so now I'm on my lunch. And I was hoping that I'd be able to put the stuff in the dryer on my lunch, but that's not the case. Oh well, that'll it'll be fine. I'll I'll make it work. I'll just like i'll just like tell the computer i have to go to the bathroom and then put the stuff in the dryer you guys don't care about this anyway let's open up clawful take that off here is his face i think the eyes are pretty good pretty straight we have like a little bit of an oops right there on his tooth i don't know if you can see that i can i can definitely see it okay so i think we already read his comic there's a really unflattering photo of Clawful. I would not want that on my paperwork. Here's his, oh, this is really awesome. So this whole arm comes off the claw, stays in. These guys are separate. Oh, wait, wait a minute. Does this mean, oh, no, 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 no. See, it doesn't have a dot. So this is one thing. This and this are two separate things that could come out. Okay, that makes sense. So there's all the things. Um, his armor comes off as well, probably. And he's got those things. Somebody on the internet, some cool internet person was saying that they like to take these and then just go like this. See, I learned too many things from the internet. And these are things that, like, I don't think that I need to know, you know? I, like, it's already bad enough that I'm spending so much money on these. <laughs> I don't need to know more things about about collecting things. So now I'm like, oh, am I gonna keep am I gonna keep these? And then that way I can sell it in 20 years. No. I think I need I don't know what I need to do. I think what I need to do is like move away and then I'll have more space. But then I'm also thinking of like just kind of like secretly putting boxes of stuff in the closet without my roommate knowing. But I don't know. I feel like then he would eventually know. Because my room is really full of all the of all the toys that I have. And, and that's a problem that I don't really love. Okay, so he is pretty much ready to come out. Here, we'll put those there because I don't want them all over the place. Oh my gosh. Let's smell. Oh yeah, he smells... Oh, it's such a weird smell. I don't even know how to describe it, but it's a great... There's your, there's your ASSMR. It's a great smell. I really like it. So, uh, Clawful is amazing. What beautiful artwork, too. I know that I read off the little caption here, but, like, I really need to take a moment to really appreciate that artwork. It's phenomenal, as usual. I would expect nothing less. So, he stands up just like so. Well, maybe not just like so. There, uh, come on, buddy. There you go. All right, there you go. And I think this guy's wave... Yeah, wave eight, right? I think that's what I said already. Yeah, wave eight and then um, wave nine is the one with like 2000X He-Man and Skeletor. And uh, who else is in wave nine? 
I don't even remember. Here's his scary face and his and his uh, bright green mace. And let's try this claw action. Oh my gosh, that works really well. So he's a very, very, uh, ouch, ooh, ow, very violent. You know, you gotta be careful with him. And his elbow bends right there, so that's really cool. And this twists all around, so he can really cut clam, like slap somebody. Uh, his armor comes off. Did they make him hairy? I don't know why they would. Ooh, wow, look at that, those uh, spikes going down his back. Now, I don't know if this is armor or if this is just like, this is what he looks like. But I think maybe it is like an extra armor. Let me push that through. Which way does it go? Oh, push it through this way. And then does his head come off? Yes, his head came off and it didn't tear his body in half. So that's definitely good. They, it looks like he's just got the regular He-Man body. I like these little spikes on the legs too. Spines maybe? I think maybe they're spines. So that's really, really, really cool. I really like this figure. I will give him, um, I think, <laughs> a 12 out of 10. But normally because I give everyone an 11 out of 10, but he gets a 12 out of 10 because, um, because of this claw action. Oh my gosh, how dangerous. So scary. Very, very terrifying. I really like the paint. I like that they went with like a nice, a nice tan color. It almost looks like Jitsu, but I don't have Jitsu right next to uh, to compare, so maybe I shouldn't say that, but I, you know, I just love all the, uh, texture and the bumps on him. He really looks like a, uh, like a little crab. And, uh, again, a 12 out of 12, or a 12 out of 10, really, really amazing figure. I love the, the scary teeth also. Um, so that's my video. I hope you're well, and I hope you're finding all the toys that you want to find and pre-ordering everything that you want from Mattel Creations. Ay, ay, ay. And getting all the Comic-Con stuff too, because, uh, that can be a nightmare. I hope you get all the stuff you want to get. Uh, adios.